So they were really fortunate to have uh, two Living for Sport athlete mentors in, Maggie Alfonsi and Mike Mullen, uh, to work with uh, Sky Sports Living for Sport Student of the Year, Wayne Instrall, and East Regional winner from the year before, Nahida Begum. But what they don't know is that they're going to have a special guest coming in later on to give them a big surprise. Like I said beforehand, today isn't just any day. Today's a very special day. We have an extra special guest coming to join us for our session. I'd like to welcome Sky Ambassador David Beckham. It's obviously so great to be here with the kids, you know, and having fun, and it brings them out of their shell, I think, when you're in this kind of situation, to have mentors, to have, you know, people to look up to is so important in sports and in life, and I think, you know, the whole initiative that Sky do, I think, is, is so incredible for kids. When I saw David Beckham walk in, I was so shocked. It just honestly didn't seem real. There was one girl who... Two minutes early, we were discussing footballers and who's your favourite footballer. And one of them said, oh, my favourite's David Beckham. He's my idol. I looked at her face and it was just priceless. The athlete mentors give something completely different to what the normal PE staff can give. They have won world championships, gold medals. They don't seem to realise, I don't think, that elite athletes come from the same background that they do. I think they put them on a pedestal, but when they actually meet them, they find out that their background is very similar to them. They've gone through the same challenges that they're facing and so they can really relate to them. Brian Robson was my hero as a young kid, you know, and I looked up to someone like him because he played for Manchester United, wore the number seven shirt for Manchester United and England, and I wanted to achieve what he achieved, and I was lucky enough to play with him and also achieve what he achieved, so it was amazing. It's a journey, and you'll learn a lot through sport, and sport will help you in your future, and it won't just help me on the pitch or on the court, but it'll actually help me when I go and get a job or at school. David taught us that we should be our own person, that we should never be afraid of who we are. It inspires the students and makes us more motivated to do what we want with our life. It made me try even more to just to impress them. The teamwork is the biggest thing. Um, I think teamwork is obviously really important in my job. Um, you have to have a certain amount of individuality. You know, my job is kicking a football around, but I, I've learned certain life skills through doing that, you know, such as the teamwork, such as the togetherness, such as the, the unity. Today has really been a successful day. It's been really filled with happiness and delight and it's been very overwhelming. It's like good enough seeing him on TV but seeing him in real life and actually being able to play these sports with him is just brilliant. We've got 75 wonderful mentors who will come around the country, come to your school, help inspire your children. And the great thing about Living for Sport is it's free. What the mentors are bringing to schools around the country and school and, and pupils around the country, that for me is it's a given, you know, any teacher that watches this kind of programme and watches and reads about the initiative, you know, they have to sign up because it's better for the schools, it's better for the kids, it's better for their lives and it's better for, for the future. So, like I said, it's a given. I think I will remember this day for the rest of my life.